Now, artist Njigdeka Akunyeli Crosby in Nigeria routinely explores the idea of home and what it means to come from somewhere. As a Nigerian expatriate living full-time in the United States, she draws inspiration from two cultures. Our U.S. correspondent Mimi Chiahemen caught up with Ndijikeda as her latest showing at the Whitney Museum in New York and filed this report. In an age of selfies, this self-portrait by Nigerian-American artist Njideka Akunyili Crosby is hard to miss. She celebrates African heritage on every canvas. Although New York's Whitney Museum features American art, curators say her work fits right in with the museum's vision. You know, the personal has always been, particularly I would say, over the past 100 years, something that artists have been very interested interested in. I think for us as a museum, it also feels like a really compelling way to engage visitors. Judica also redefines what it means to be an American artist at a crucial time for identity politics and American history. We've become more and more interested in kind of complicating the notion of who is an American artist. And Akineli Crosby was born in Nigeria but moved to the United States. And a lot of the work really deals with her dual identity of being both a Nigerian and now an American. Committed to creating a narrative both personal and universal, Njideka often draws inspiration from family photographs that have cross-cultural resonance. Uh, this is a picture that I do use fairly often in my work. It's a picture from my first Holy Communion. And with this, I'm thinking of traditions we've inherited and how um, new things are born out of mimicry. But the thing with mimicry is that it's similar, but it's not quite the same. And in that difference, something new actually comes out of it. Although she mostly lives and works in Los Angeles, Njideka tries to capture the cultural mosaic of contemporary African life. The funny thing with this picture is that what she's wearing will be considered traditional attire. Uh, so that's also something I, I interrogate in my work, is this question of what is tradition at this point in a country like Nigeria. Um, so we're talking about the British influence, the American influence, but also the 200 plus tribes that are coming together into like one unified culture. It's fitting then that Njideka uses mixed media, paint, pencil and collage to colorfully juxtapose the many parts of who she is. As the patches in the quilt of American culture continue to shift, self-portraiture is an increasingly essential way to capture the ever-changing faces and their stories. With images like Akunya Lee Crosby's, curators at the Whitney Museum say they're embracing the idea of flexible identities. Mimi Chahman, CCTV, New York.